Let's move on to Kentucky, one of the premier Senate races in the country. And when you see a new candidate, Allison Lundergan Grimes is the Democrat, running against Mitch McConnell, who wants to be the Senate majority leader. He's now the Senate Republican leader. When you're running for the first time for national office, federal office, sometimes uh, you get the test on foreign policy. Listen to her talking about Israel. The Iron Dome has been a big reason uh, why Israel has been able to withstand the terrorists that uh, have tried to tunnel their way in. Now, if you couldn't hear that clearly, the Iron Dome has been the big reason why Israel has been able to withstand the terrorists that have tried to tunnel their way in. The Iron Dome is an air defense, Patriot missiles, other anti-missile system. It doesn't deal with tunnels underground. It deals with rockets in the sky. Right. Now, you could argue, and they're arguing now, that you can make a sophisticated argument that an anti-missile defense system allows you then to focus on right. rooting out the tunnels, and that's what she was trying to say. The problem is this is a candidate who, just a few days ago, we got to look at her internal campaign memo that said if she had the right position on Israel, really pro-Israel stance, she could raise a lot of money. And her position was, in their words, her own campaign's words, words TBD. <laughs> so she has an authenticity problem already on this issue, and this just underscores it. I think, the, I think the thing that this shows, and we all know this having written about Middle East issues, is that when it comes to the Israeli-Palestinian debate, your language is going to be parsed <laughs> right. constantly. Right. You have to be so careful with what you say. And it's a really complicated issue. Right. And right. experience has been one of the things that McConnell's campaign has been going after with her, and this might play into that. I think the TBD was in the Georgia Senate race, not the Kentucky Senate race. Michelle Nunn versus right. Allison Graham. That's okay. That, That's okay. It's the same, same dynamic. You get a candidate running for the first time who has to deal with these issues. They get troublesome sometimes. The key test for the candidate is how do they clean it up. So we'll watch the Kentucky Thanks Senate race to see up. how that plays off. That's what I'm here for, Mr. Fournier. It's been a long time. That's what they hired me for many, many years <laughs> ago in another different place. Julie Ron, thanks for coming in.